Here we go, guys. Threw out a prawn bait on the ultra light tackle. Got a nice looking bream here. Water. There we go. What are you going to do with it? Are we going to put it back? Yeah, I think so. Alright, so this one, he's looked down pretty far down, his, down in the throat. So we're going to keep him for the pot. The eagle size is 30 centimeters and you're allowed two per day for the first there you go guys, you saw uh, my son Josh just get a nice little bronze bream. Uh, we fished last night, uh, a little bit quiet, a couple of blue rays, lost one or two really big inedibles, uh, no cob in those Mataharis we were looking for, but uh, there was one bronzy, quite badly hooked, so we couldn't get the hook out, so it's decided we'll keep that one for the pan. Uh, I might keep one as well, then we got one each. So that was on a little bit of prawn. And one and one single cracker uh, and half a prawn. Okay, well you saw uh, you saw Josh got get that little bronze bream that was badly hooked, so we kept it. Acons asked very nicely that he can uh, he can eat it. Look what he's done here. He's uh, scaled it and then he's just cut little slits into it. All he's done, all he wants is a little bit of salt. And then what are you going to do? You're going to put that on the bra? Yes. Okay, lucky. Just check this one out. We'll uh, we'll show you exactly how they're going to do it. Then these guys are going to have a fresh bronzy. Simple one ingredient on the rocks, bronze beam. The guys have been doing this for years. It's like a Cajun, Cajun crispy skin bronze beam that you get in a restaurant. Done right here on the rocks in the Northern Cross Gulf. Look how lovely and white that bronze beam flesh is. Look at it. Tastes just like the sea. Really. Actually, unbelievable. Right? Eh? 